Hey y'all, it's me, your girl Tiff. Um, <clears throat> I'm going through crossbodom. I can never say that word right. <laughs> now it's day. Damn. Day nine of going through crossbodom. Um, postpartum. <laughs> Don't judge me, y'all. Um, it's been very hard. I haven't been sleeping within those nine days of, you know, having, giving birth to my baby girl. It's very, very, very hard. Like, everybody is different. When people say, oh, is it wasn't hard for me, everybody, um, postpartum tolerance level is totally different and it's okay. You know, at one point I find myself just getting to... I'm sorry, I'm um, feeding her. Um, getting frustrated because of lack of sleep. I haven't been sleeping. And it's like, if I sleep, it's like two hours out of a day. So imagine two hours um, out of a day for nine days. Um, I'm trying to get to know my baby. I'm trying to get to know her, her sleep pattern, what things that she do like, things that she don't like, her positions and so on and so forth, because, you know, they've been in this world just a short amount of time. And, um, you know, it's just, it, 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 become, it becomes like a headache sometimes. And it, it is a, a challenge, it's a big challenge. Um, but it's, I'm, I'm stuttering girl, I, I don't, I mean, guys, I don't know. But it, it's a challenge, though. It's a really, really big challenge for me. And don't get me wrong, because every time I pick her up when she cries, you know, I want to cry with her, you know? And it's like, okay, what can I do to make you stop crying? I already changed your diaper. You're full. It's like, what do you want from me? <laughs> Some ton of love and care, you know? And I understand that. You can't always hold your baby because your baby going to be very dependent of you holding them every time when they cry. I get it. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, as a first time mom, I just feel like, you know, your baby wants you. You know, your baby want to be underneath you because your baby been in your womb for nine months attached to you. So now that is like nine days later, it's like, I don't want to be detached. But... After a while, she's going to have a sleep pattern. I'm going to, you know, try my hardest to make sure she has a decent sleep pattern. That way I can go to sleep. Because, you know, when a baby is born, you know, they sleep any time of the day. You just, you know, some people be like, oh, um, you know, get your baby up, you know, do this, do that so they can sleep good at night. But then again, it's like, okay. I, she goes, she go to sleep. Like, okay, if I try to wake her up, it's like, okay, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. <laughs> like I can't, you know, I just let her sleep. And I understand that I have to get in the habit of when she sleep, I sleep. You know what I'm saying? But it's a working process. I know that, um, it's going to get better. And, you know, overall I'm, I'm excited. Like, I'm excited, and um, I guess I'll go to sleep later, but I'll get it together, guys. So, yeah, I just wanted to come on here and just show, not show, but share how I've been feeling because everybody is different. All right, later.